Hey, this is Brett, and this 2022 Jeep Grand Cherokee Overland is stock number 22J21A. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Grand Cherokee headquarters. This 2022 Jeep Grand Cherokee Overland has the 5.7 liter V8 Hemi engine. It's paired up with the eight speed automatic transmission, puts out 360 horsepower. This Grand Cherokee has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop per the state of Wisconsin inspection process. As a fresh oil and filter change, all the fluids have been checked and topped off and this Jeep is 100% ready to go. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video, inside, start it up, take a look under the hood and give you the most accurate representation that I can. Diamond black pearl coat is the color and I shoot all my videos in 4K, so if you have HD capabilities, turn them on now because it is your best way to check out the quality, condition, options, and cleanliness of the vehicle before seeing it in person. As you go down the driver's side here, rear quarter looks really good, as do the doors. I didn't see any dents, I didn't see any dings. Very nice, clean, and reflective paint. If you like the video, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is youtube.com slash summit auto. Click the bell notifications and you'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day here at Summit Automotive. This one comes with the 20 inch painted and polished aluminum wheels. It has Bridgestone Acopia tires. These are 26550 R20s. And I would say they have probably about 70 to 80% of the tread left on them. Frame and underbody from what you can see is in really nice shape. This one does have the four corner air suspension on it. Front bumper is in excellent shape. You get the chrome tow hooks, LED fog lamps, front bumper parking sensors, the chrome trimmed seven slotted grill, and the chrome Jeep lettering on the hood. I didn't see any major dents or dings on the hood. Looks really good. And the passenger side front fender is in fantastic condition as well. No scuffs or scrapes on the passenger side wheel. And as you go down this side of this 2022 Jeep Grand Cherokee, take note of how clean that body is and just how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. I take these HD videos, so if you are far away or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the vehicle, hear the vehicle, and have confidence in what you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises and you can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. If this video helps you make that buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful, and that Brett sent you. Back wheel's in excellent shape, and the back tires have just as much tread as the front tires. Coming around to the back of the vehicle, the rear bumper is in great shape. It does have the backup parking sensors, the chrome-tipped dual rear exhaust, the full towing package, which includes a receiver hitch, four pin, and seven pin wiring and that rear gate is in excellent condition as well. It is a power lift gate, so that goes up like so. You do get the cover for the receiver hitch back here. We put those back there so they don't go missing. Uh, factory subwoofer, you get a spare tire on this one as well. And those seats do fold down for extra storage. I'll show you how that works in just a second. Press that button, it'll beep at you three times and then begin its descent. For full disclosure, this back wheel, just as nice as the rest. I didn't see any scuffs or scrapes on any of the wheels. And down the rest of this side, once again, no dents or dings, looks really good. Does have the blind spot monitoring, heated mirrors, and built-in directional signals. Inside the Overland package gives you the black leather interior. There are no rips or tears on the seats. You get the Overland embossed in the backrest. Both these seats are heated and cooled, factory floor mats, auto headlamps, power telescopic and tilt steering wheel, wood grain trim on the dash and doors, memory driver seat. This one does have the back massager on the uh, seats as well. Power windows, locks and mirrors. These mirrors do power fold in. Um, I always like showing both sides so you know that both sides are working properly. Take a quick look at the back seats. They are just as clean as the front seats, no rips or tears back here. It does have the latch child safety system for any child car seats 
you may have. Factory floor mats back here. These back seats are heated on the outboard side and you do get rear climate controls back here. A 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in, two USBs and two USB-Cs. These seats do fold down like so. You can see just how nice and flat that they go, which is great if you have to haul a bunch of extra stuff. And then they go up like that. You do get cup holders back here. Back doors trimmed out like the front ones. You get this like ambient lighting on there as well. You get the rear window shade, which is really nice, especially if you got kids right in the back. And child safety locks on the back doors. Inside and bottoms of the doors all look fantastic. We'll hop inside, check out the miles, the radio, and everything that this vehicle has to offer on the interior. You get the big instrument cluster here. I think it's like a 10 point 10.2 instrument cluster. Uh, digital speedometer, compass display, outside temperature display. Everything's nice and digital. Uh, you get all the stuff here and uh, very nice and clean. Comes with the heated leather wrap steering wheel. Adaptive cruise controls and regular cruise controls on the right. Uh, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left. You do get the paddle shifters on the back and audio controls on the back of the steering wheel as well. You get the wood grain trim on there too. This one has the Uconnect 5 radio. Uh, I believe this is the 10.1 inch display, AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. It does have the factory navigation system on there. There is Highway 41, so that is working nicely. You have all your different apps on here, including the ambient lighting that you can change the color, the uh, heated seats, cooled seats, all that good stuff. This one has the Macintosh um, sound system in it as well, the massaging seats, which are pretty cool. Um, and then you have your climate controls and everything else, Android Auto. Um, just a lot of stuff that you can do with this radio. So also have your backup camera, which is nice and crystal clear. And you can zoom in on that receiver hitch to get hooked up to your boat camper or trailer the first time every time. Up here is your lane departure warning, park, uh, stability control, parking sensors, and your hazard lights. Down here, heated and cooled seat buttons, climate controls, radio controls, wireless cell phone charge pad, USB, USB-Cs, AUX jack, 8-speed automatic transmission, the quadra lift system. For the uh, air suspension, you can raise it and lower it. You have rock, sand, mud, snow, auto, and sport for your four-wheel drives. This one has a four-wheel drive low and a neutral setting for flat towing and a downhill assist control. Keyless entry with remote start. That is in nice shape. And the passenger side floor mat and seat are in excellent condition as well. This one also has the panoramic sunroof. Second row fixed. Power sunroof in the front. You do get assist and SOS buttons up here. Sunshade and sunroof controls and map lights. You also get home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. This one has the rear view mirror camera, so it's a digital video display of what's going on behind you. If you want it just a regular mirror, you can just flip that um, and you can change the brightness and the angle that it's pointing to. So a lot of cool stuff on there. Let's start it up and take a look under the hood. Also check out all those LED lights in the front. Starts right up, no check engine lights or anything like that. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video, you've been able to verify the quality condition options and of course cleanliness of this Grand Cherokee inside and out. There are all your LED lights and under the hood, we have the 5.7 liter V8 Hemi engine. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth once again. This Jeep has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. Shocks are doing a nice job holding that hood up. There's the emissions sticker. And this Jeep is 100% ready to go. I would highly recommend this Grand Cherokee from a quality and condition standpoint. I'd ship this one to California, Florida, Texas, New York, wherever, whoever's going to get it is going to be very happy with the quality and condition. 
And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, half tons, three quarter tons, one tons, Cherokees, Grand Cherokees, you name it, we got it. Go to that website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. Click the bell notifications and you'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day here at Summit Automotive. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to more Grand Cherokee videos like this one in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this ultra clean 2022 Jeep Grand Cherokee Overland in diamond black pearl coat. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.